Hi children, welcome to New Way India K2 Tool Academy. In this video, we learn about uh, chapter 2 biological classification, 5 kingdom classification. What you learn in this video? You learn just uh, a brief uh, introduction to 2 kingdom classification and then who proposed 5 kingdom classification. Then, main criteria for 5 kingdom kingdom classification by R. H. Whittaker and what are the characteristics of the five kingdoms these are the things of, um, topics we learn in this video two kingdom classification first it is given by Linnaeus he divided the entire organisms into just two kingdoms one is plant and one is animalia Plant includes plants, animalia includes animals. Means include bacteria, micro everything under uh, all organisms into only two categories, two kingdoms. But this system failed to distinguish eukaryotes and prokaryotes, unicellular and multicellular organisms, and photosynthetic green algae and non photosynthetic fungi organisms. He has not differentiated different organisms, eukaryotes, prokaryotes, unicellular and multicellular, photosynthetic and non-photosynthetic organisms. These organisms are not differentiated in two kingdom classification. Hence, there is a need for a further classification which came in 1969 by R.H. Whittaker. That is a five kingdom classification. You need to understand five. What are those five? These are the five. One is monera, one is protista, one is fungi, one is plantae, and animalia. Try to memorize these uh, five kingdoms: monera, protista, fungi, plantae, and animalia. On what basis he divided those? Uh, what is the criteria? used by the Whittaker for classification. One is a cell structure. Second one is a thalamus organization. And third one is mode of nutrition. And the fourth one is a reproduction and a phylogenetic relationships. You may get a, a beta or question, a small answer like this. What is the criteria used by Whittaker for his five kingdom classification? You need to write these five points cell structure thalamus organization mode of nutrition reproduction and phylogenetic relationships and what are the characteristics of uh, those uh, five kingdoms you know already these are the five kingdoms monera protista fungi plantae and animalia and he based on uh, cell structure reproduction and nuclear membrane presence or absence something like that so, if you compare, like make a chart, this is very, very important from your examination point of view. Try to understand, for example, cell type. See, these four are eukaryotic, this one is prokaryotic. So, you need to remember, Monera is different in the cell type. At the same time, cell wall. Cell wall is absent completely in animalia, means animals. Remaining in plants, fungi. Uh, protista and monera present but here without cellulose with cellulose present in some cases so mainly you need to remember animalia cell wall is absent cell type is prokaryotic monera you don't need to remember these four because all are other all others are eukaryotic nuclear membrane absent present 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 so this thing you have to remember means nuclear membrane is absent in monera monera means you will come to know what are the members then body organization cellular cellular multicellular loose tissue tissue or organ tissue organ and organ system from cells to organ systems that is development cellular cellular up to protesta then multicellular then tissue organs in plant and animal is organ systems like reproductive system circulatory system, nervous system, like this you will find different organ systems you will find and mode of nutrition, generally autotrophic, 
ऑटो ट्राफिक एट्रो ट्राफिक ऑटो ट्राफिक एट्रो ट्राफिक ओके सो दीज थ्री आर ऑटो ट्राफिक एंड दीज टू आर एट्रो ट्राफिक यू नीड टू try to memorize this chart so that it will help you in your competitive exams and answering many questions in your exams i hope you understood what are the uh, these questions what are the five kingdom classification what is the criteria he used for classification and what are the characteristics of five kingdoms um, monera protista fungi animalia plantae animalia generally in animals no cell wall prokaryotes and eukaryotes prokaryotes are monera the first one so like this you need to memorize then you can you can in future you will understand many concepts based on this classification see you in the next video thank you so much please subscribe to the channel like the video or comment or share thank you so much